Ooh, interesting hand. Ooh, okay. I think I can keep this, honestly. Uh, maybe Spellstone's not actually very good, though. I don't know about the Explosive Trap, honestly, but oh, Kobold can fix any weaknesses. That's good, okay. I just don't want to get a totally dead hand, and I think this hand is fine. So they've got Gem and Mummy Magic. Oh, Mummy Magic Paladin. Interesting, okay. guess Valinir probably I only have a few minions I'd be a little sad if it hits the kobold though but I definitely don't care about the other two so definitely oh wow dude what an insane draw okay uh, I mean I'll play Elyra because explosive trap next turn is pretty likely and I think this is very unlikely to die so that's fine I mean it's a three five if nothing else a turn one three five is not terrible it's not great, but it's definitely not terrible. So we can kick off with the explosive trap and then, well, I don't know if I hit the henchman, am I playing the henchman instead? Probably, let's see what we hit here. Hopefully not kobold is the main thing. That's fine, that's fine. Do I play this now for the Lyra or waits play it next turn with the Huntress and play the henchman now. Playing the henchman now doesn't really achieve much. No, I think this has a more high chance to disrupt their, their thinking. They might make a weird play because of this secret potentially, and this of course scales anyway. So Huntress without a secret is still going to be fine when it's a 7-6 Valinir. That's okay. Uh... Atreus in hand is chill. I think we need to tidy up the board here a little. Next turn, Pain Henchman would be good if I had a target for it. Oh, they're just using Humble Blessings right now. So we could hit for 10 for free, huh? In that case, I guess we go Eagle Horn here still. I think it's time for Kobold quite yet gonna be this, this next valineer might be iffy we'll see but i'm kind of just setting up lethal hits here soon we got to worry about like well that actually is really gross for instance <laughs> it's really that's a great example of things we have to worry about my god dude what a swing card that is jeez so boy And I guess we're racing a little bit here. I don't know. I'm like really close, right? They're at 10 and then this is technically 8, 12, right? If they proc both of these and don't play a taunt, I have a lethal setup. So I guess we'll see. They're going to win off this crazy value of these three threes if I'm not careful though, so... It's not like I have all day. Havish can also help me find lethals too. Mind if I roll need? Yeah, I might literally need nine mana before Motion the Night goes off if they don't have some spells. Okay, so Havish here could be nuts. Oh, Tracking could help me find a lethal too. That's really nice. Explosive Trap is pick number one always here. <sighs> Motion to Night again is just not really likely to connect, but they don't know that, I guess. I mean, this is fine. I can still try to huffer my way through stuff too. Oh, that's a great target. I was worried it was going to hit like Denathrius or maybe Kobold. Kobold wouldn't necessarily be the end of the world, but... So, Explosive Trap here takes them to three. Either Motion Denied at this stage is lethal. I know you might think, why you pick both? But just in case they have healing or something, right? It's it's okay to have overkill. And I didn't think the other cards were likely to make a big impact here. Because once you get Explosive... Ah, healing. Yeah, see? Exactly. It's funny. Now if they play two more cards, they will just die. <laughs> they would just die. Uh... Play, play two more for some reason, bro. Oh, that's only one more, sadly. Okay. Uh, 
I don't think this ever results in a lethal, right? Unfortunately. No, Dunbaldar is probably the best pick, though. Scorpid could find me lethals, but this finds... Well, I don't know. This doesn't really have any explosive traps anymore. Maybe it is actually Scorpid. Just to have outs later. I'm not, I'm not sure there. It's a tough one. Getting close to Denathrius, but he's he's unlikely to, to actually connect because they're going to have so many uh, minions. I mean, their minions aren't going to have huge health totals, of course, but still going to have a lot of minions. Taunt is also a real big pain for me. Next turn is when they would most naturally play three cards. Are they going to play three cards next turn, I guess, is the question. I need Wand, too, by the way. Man, Wand would be so sick. Just to, to clear these taunts and stuff. Congrats on 100k. Oh, thanks, Ares and Kobe One, guys. Wow, thank you for the 300 bits, man. Hey, Archivist Owl, dude. Thanks for the kind words. Yeah, thank you, everybody. Me Mega milestones are rare. That's really appreciate the appreciation, guys. That's really nice. So I only played one card this turn, so this turn's not going to be the turn. Next turn will be the turn, but they don't have enough. They don't have enough space left on board, right? I need to. I need Wand. Eaglehorn is just totally dead. <sighs> Another motion denied, are you kidding me? <laughs> I mean, really? I just don't really see a play here. What have we here. I need to, like, clear enough of their stuff so that they have board space, right? Like, maybe they... Maybe if I kobold, they, they commit more? I mean, I lose Denathrius, but is Denathrius gonna matter? It's two turns away, aren't I just gonna die? Like, they already have 15 damage on board, and I'm at 27. So I, I don't think Denathrius matters, right? In which case the Kobold would be the play. I just don't see how Denathrius is good enough. Let's play Kobold and try to force them to remove it a little bit. Uh, probably just hero power is fine. Bait? 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 It's bait! It's, it's Millhouse bait. Go, go ahead and play all those spells, buddy. I know you got a lot of spells you really want to play. I just know you've got so many spells you're looking to play. <laughs> Come on. I know you got three or four spells that are really good to play. Come on, buddy. I know you have so many spells. Just sitting up there waiting to be played. So many spells. I mean, they know it's motion denied at this stage, right? So they, they would have to make a just astoundingly big mistake to uh, to play a third card. Are we getting debated? The greatest decision in the history of Hearthstone I made to get both emotion denied. Because I said we might need excess freaking damage. <laughs> I can't believe it. That's so insane. I cannot believe it. <laughs> Oh my god. Oh my god. Millhouse for lethal, bro. That actually... That actually might be the greatest Millhouse in the history of Hearthstone. I mean, legitimately. Wow, dude. What a, what a day to have it, too. 100,000 Twitch followers and the greatest Hearthstone in, a, in like a real Hearthstone game, right? Oh my god. <laughs> oh. oh my god, dude. I cannot believe that. <laughs>